This is Rob Montgomery in Berlin with a quick film test with the iPhone 11 Pro Max, Filmic Pro, and the Moment app comparing log filming and LUTs used in low light conditions. This is the Festival of Lights time in Berlin, a great chance to test these modes with normal and time-lapse photography. Of course, I locked down all my shots on a tripod. I even used a Syrup Genie to do some time lapses with some pan moves and the Moondog Labs anamorphic lens. This is Filmic Pro, time lapse in log mode. And I used the Filmic Pro LUT. And I adjusted the green channel to compensate for the red, taking over a little too much in the shots. I'm looking for highlight detail, and I'm really impressed with what I'm able to capture here in this longer time lapse in Filmic Pro, just using the standard log and the standard Filmic log LUT to delog the file. And then I compared that by using the Moment app, which also lets you film in log mode with an anamorphic lens at 100 megabits per second. You can even go up to 50 frames per second. Uh, and you can see this is what it looks like flattened out in the app. And then when you correct it in LumaFusion, I'm using uh, a different LUT. I auditioned a number of different LUTs, and the one that I found that worked particularly well with this app's use of log, even though it may not be a true log, was the Technicolor LUT to Rec 709. At any rate, these are some first look tests comparing different types of log shooting at night with the new iPhone Pro Max. Hey, let me know in the comments what you guys think.